Why, Luger, I've been waiting for you. Thanks. Any leads on your brother's whereabouts? Well, as it turns out, I have news for you of both varieties. Good and bad. Which one first? I would like to recruit you as an agent in our corporation. <laughs> Don't act so surprised. It makes perfect sense. I've been keeping my eye on you this whole time. You never back down from difficult situations. More importantly, you have the strength to face them. I'd wager you've been doing more than just keeping an eye on him. You've been testing Luger. You can't get the true measure of a man by observing from a distance. You said there was bad news, too. Mr. Kresnik's going on the police's most wanted list. So they're gonna throw Luger in jail? Your life's about to get a lot tougher. But if you become one of my agents, I'll keep the police off your back, even if I have to get pushy. He doesn't even have a choice. This is blackmail. I failed to mention that an agent's salary is considerable. You'll be killing two birds with one stone. You can avoid arrest and pay off that massive loan almost overnight, provided you show me results, of course. <gasps> what kind of results? No fractured dimensions. Fractured dimensions? Surely you've noticed them. Worlds like ours, but not? Think of this flower as our prime dimension, a world where history flows in a way that's familiar to us. But it's not the only blossom. There are offshoots. When one of these appears, it disperses soul energy from the prime dimension. Our dimension, in other words. Wait, it disperses? That can't be good. And what happens if we don't do anything about it? Ultimately, souls will vanish from the prime dimension. Of course, this means humans will die out as well. Whoa, whoa, time out. This all sounds pretty far-fetched. Olympias going dry, the failure of spyrite technology. What if I were to tell you those effects were caused by the loss of soul energy from the prime dimension? It can't be true. Oh, but it is. Spirius has been working to save our world by eliminating its counterparts in the fractured dimensions. How could you possibly eliminate an entire world? <laughs> that is a question for our friend Luger here. His Chromatis transformation has the power we need to infiltrate and destroy these parasitic realities. The power to destroy a world. Luger, for the sake of this world, the true world, you must help us. Don't let me down. You're officially a DODA agent of Spirius. One thing I still don't get. What's causing these fractured dimensions? It's not a what, it's a who. A great spirit of Canaan. Kronos. The land of Canaan? Another great spirit? There is nothing to fear. We have in our possession the power needed to oppose him. Come to the underground training area, and I will show you how to wield it. I have to admit, being an agent for the Spirius Corporation is kind of a big deal. But are you sure about this? Thought so. But if the CEO says you can handle it, that's a big thumbs up. I mean, my editor will barely let me take down a classified ad. This could be your big chance to make it big. Ugh, what reporter uses big twice in one sentence? 